This episode of Comedy Bang Bang is brought to you by Squarespace and Gimlet. Have you ever listened to a podcast and thought, I could do that? Probably this one. Well, you are in luck because Squarespace, the juggernaut of podcast advertising, has partnered with Gimlet Creative to find the next great podcast host. To take over this job? (laughs) Maybe, who knows? The search will be documented in a podcast by Jonathan Goldstein, host of Gimlet Media's Heavyweight Podcast. And if you're a U.S. resident over the age of 18, you can submit your podcast idea by visiting castingcallshow.com. Submissions close May 21st, so don't wait. Submit your idea for the next great podcast at castingcallshow.com. That's castingcallshow.com by May 21st. There once was a man from Nantucket who had an average-sized penis and worked in sales until he died of sleep apnea at 52. Welcome to Comedy Bang Bang. Thank you to Colfax McLivernick for that catchphrase submission. Not sure if it's going to stick or not. We'll see next week if I say it again. Welcome to the show. Scott Ackerman here for another edition of Comedy Bang Bang. And what an edition it is. One full calendar year ago, we had a podcast. This is what we call them, podcast. We had an episode of this show where we caught up with a few old friends of ours, and we made one new friend. And, um, of course, I am talking about the owners and proprietors of uh, the Honeybee Honey Bee Farm. I can't remember exactly what the uh, title of it was. Uh, Calvin's Twins, Bee Honey Bee Farm, and Horse Fighting. <laughs> Emporium? Faci- Emporium facility. <laughs> it's changed. We, it's we've changed. done some rebranding in the last year. Done okay. some building. It's bigger than just a ranch now. But it, but would it not, and I'll introduce you in a second, be the Calvin's <laughs> triplets because, well, I mean, we'll get to this story because uh, three of them are here. We first spoke to them years and years ago when we found out about their surprising stories. And, th- and this is why I enjoy doing the show is because quite often we'll book just regular people on the show, but the, the, the more you you dig into their stories, you, the more you realize that every person is fascinating in their own way. And these two are no exception. We're and- fascinating in several ways. <laughs> many, many ways. <laughs> many ways. Okay, when we'll... There's a third way, Scotty. <laughs> you recall our newest, bestest, westest, testest, flin flestest, shib clestest, Calvin's triplet there ever was? Well, please, please, please. I'm only uh, one third of a part of a perfect trio. <laughs> <laughs> the Holy Trinity, as they say. I, I, I guess so. Uh, we first got to know them as twins uh, who work together and live together and laugh together and love together. Uh, ah! Although I, I guess I do, well, that was an example of the laughing not together. Well, and physically, <laughs> you can tell I got into my sort of uh, neutral living stance. <laughs> right. <laughs> So together, you you both got into the neutral living stance. No, standing here in our neutral living stance. You seem ready to pounce. Full of love. It's a very it's a very grounded, very strong stance. It, you have a low center of gravity. It, it, the Calvin's estate br- breeds a very boisterous, blunstrous, flim flunstrous, <laughs> hot pocket. In your tum tumstress oh. type of boy. That's a that's a new one. I haven't heard that one before. Uh, yeah. Are you always I workshopping these? I keep a journal <laughs> okay, by good. my bedside. Um, we first got to know them. They are, of course, related. They're brothers by birth and by choice. Right. Okay. Uh, a lot of people don't uh, really have both of those, but you guys uh, ha- have chosen to stay together. Um, mm-hmm. And uh, they might be the family that prays together because they certainly are staying together. Uh, we we first... do pray together every night before bed. We sit down against the bed and we do pray to the good Lord. All different gods. All different gods. All different beds. All, All different, different beds. Everybody gets to pick. All right, tonight's my bed, so and let's press against it. Yo. And is it a different god depending on which bed you're in? We, so. have a, we, we, we reach into our 10-gallon. 
We have a 10 gallon. We reach into it. A 10 gallon hat, you mean? Uh, uh, no, no. no. A picking <laughs> no, no, bucket. No. <laughs> we have a 10 gallon picking bucket. Do you know what a picking bucket is? I, I, do, I guess I've never heard of a picking bucket. Well, Google it. Okay, uh, nothing is coming up. I'm oh, sorry. oh uh, <laughs> shamefully underrepresented <laughs> on Google. Oh no, it's zero matches oh, in zero point one four seconds. Ah, That's right. Well. There's not even a. Sp- they, they're not even asking us if we meant anything else. <laughs> <laughs> no, nope. they're just saying there cannot be anything else. That's why I bing it. I just, I'm still binging. You got to bing. <laughs> you got to bing. Still binging. When you're looking for a picking bucket, you got to bing it. <laughs> so. I first got to know the two of them, uh, and then the third last uh, year came into our lives. I'm, of course, talking about Bever Hopox, Chico Hands, mm. and Bisbee St. Hancock. Mm. They are also known as the Calvin's Triplets. Welcome, guys. Bever and Chico and Bisbee are here. And we brought in Petunia. Oh, oh, Petunia's here. Petunia. Oh. Calm down there, Petunia. Calm Easy. down. <laughs> what a sweet, Easy, sweet Petunia. little baby. She's a champion, but she's a lady. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you, you have her dressed up as uh Oh, yeah. As a stormtrooper. <laughs> that? <laughs> like a Star Wars. From Star Wars. Not a, not yeah, a Nazi. Not a, not, not no, no. A Nazi. I don't no. want to paint the wrong picture for anyone. That's right. Like it's Star Wars. Pure stormtrooper. Uh, Star Wars. Uh, That's right. Yeah, so... Uh, Kids love it. Mm-hmm. They come in, and you can sell it to them. You can say, would you like to ride a Stormtrooper? That's right. Mm-hmm. Bisbee is a huge Star Wars fan. Yeah. Is this part of your business now, sure. is riding the horses that are going to fight later? Well, that's one thing. Yeah. We have a meeting every Monday morning now mm-hmm. uh, at 11 p.m., and we talk about... <laughs> Pre-prayer. <laughs> Pre-prayer. Is Pre- that, Pre- is that Pre- Monday pick? morning, you say? Every every <laughs> Monday morning at, <laughs> at 11 p.m.? <laughs> you guys have a very unusual sleep cycle. We only follow uh, Greenwich Mean Time. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, we never yeah. change our clocks. That's right. We think daylight savings is a hoax. It's a hoax and a scam. There. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Chico. Um, so, and you, and you guys mind, have, we a, think have a of creative things we can do to mm-hmm. uh, to th- expand help the business. Our business thrive. Yeah, and this is one of the new one ones. Of is ones. hey, why aren't the kids paying to ride these horses before they knock each other to death? Right. Yes. Right. Well, first of all, your options decrease by fifty percent <laughs> right. post fight. Mm-hmm. Pre fight, you got the the pickings. You got two options mm-hmm. there because you never. You never ride a horse Uh-oh. like more than twenty minutes out from fight. That's true. Because as right. soon as you ride a horse and it and it's and it's before twenty minutes before they're in fighting mode, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. they just become a riding horse. Yeah. There's just a riding horse at that point. They're not a fighting horse. Yeah, right. That's right. And then, but if you are in that twenty minute window with that horse, you've been training and breeding right. and and. Prepping for the fight, but they'll they'll hold on to that. Their brains can't fully oh, form and go like, oh wait, maybe riding's what we're supposed to be doing. That's right. Mm-hmm. Horse never forgets. Does it cause any sort of cycle? within twenty minutes of a fight? Right, then they do forget. Does it then cause after the twenty minute marker? They definitely forget. Right. Was right. the premise of what I was but, explaining? Yep. But never. Brains just but get never erased. But never for forgets. <laughs> you guys twenty. Got to get it on the same right. page on one of your Monday morning meetings at <laughs> eleven p.m. This is why they take so long. <laughs> That's true. But we said. Uh, we set up some horses with all sorts of different costumes. Different things. You name it, we can have a, a horse ready for you if you call ahead. Because Chico's a hell of a seamstress. I have been showing and a seaman uh, since I was a young boy. And You've uh, been doing what with semen? Uh, uh, semen. It's, uh, it's <laughs> yeah, a I verb. heard you. Uh, it's what a person does when they're uh, making seams. You call oh, that semen. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, I see. so you've been making semen how so long? So I've been, you know, making... Since you were 13 years old? Since a young boy. He was a very... Semen with my, I've been seaming with my hands since I was uh, a tween. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. A twink. He, he was... <laughs> I said twink. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Get that twink off your brain. <laughs> sorry, he I was don't know what I was thinking. Get that twink off your Our brain. Our mother was so proud because he was, he was the first... Oh. Your dear to be semen, mother. he was my uh, poor mama. God rest her oh, soul. God rest her soul. Who, who, who? Bisbee. Bisbee yes. is, is, is we, we discovered. Did you do a twenty three and me? Uh, we did a three and me. We did a three and me. It was just the three of it us. Was, it was a, a little cheaper. 
And yeah. did you guys seem into anything, or did you? We did. Yeah. Chico made us gorgeous suits, <laughs> so and he was semen all over us. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> he was, we went in because we did it yeah. within a doctor's office. We went straight to the <laughs> yeah. source. Yeah, did you get a any? blood test of source? Was there was anything a, on your face or oh, on your well, chest? Oh, we did these or? wonderful hoods. He was semen. <laughs> a semen from, on like everybody's our face chin. too. The semen he did was at our chin. And it went straight to the crown of our head. We this right. the semen cool. that he did around the crown of our head was just people. We were walking down the street and they'd be like, "That's they got, some good they got some good semen." On yeah, their heads. it was great semen. It 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 almost came right down along the cheeks. That's right, down the chin, <laughs> like a, a, a right. like a gambit hood of you, semen, like a gambit hood of semen. Gambit from X Men. And by the way, right. Chico, is that the that's official? An, what you call like a murder of crows? <laughs> exactly, it's like a gambit hood of exactly. semen. Oh man, that was a gambit hood of semen, <laughs> and I look divine. <laughs> and so you found out you are officially. Last time you were on the show, we didn't know if you had the same mother. Yes. Right. So you do have the same mother, and and mm-hmm. what did she used to? She was very proud. You were saying of uh, Chico over of here. Chico, because he was such an early semener. Yeah. I I was uh, tapped at a young age to sew together all sorts of costumes mm-hmm. for the Halloweens and mm-hmm. other pagan holidays and. Uh, and none of the Christian holidays? No, none of the Christian holidays. Oh, no, no, no. Are you guys not religious? I, I don't think that's ever come up here. Well, we pray. Yes, we pray every well, Yeah, I was going to say, you pray, but to different, different gods. gods. Right. Yeah. And a different god every day of the week. Right. Just Polytheologists. To co- cover your bases? That's a baseball term. I don't know if you guys follow sports. Uh, of course we do. Of course. Uh, of course we, are. we do. <laughs> we are. We're sportsmen ourselves. We are the are. premier horsemen. In all of the Florida Panhandle horse fighting right divisions, That's but wait, right. do you guys have also have like a horse baseball league? We have a softball mm-hmm. league. Softball, I, sorry, yeah, yeah. There's only three of us. That's right. it's co-ed. It's 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 recreational. That's right. But there's three of you. You but guys we are all. It, we have some horses play with us. Oh, yeah. okay. Is that what Petunia's doing here today? Is Petunia a fighting horse or a softball horse? I, Petunia's gonna... a champion. <laughs> Oh, Petunia, Petunia, there, Petunia. 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 oh, she's Come getting on. humble. Oh. She's getting humble. Uh-oh. Turning her face in the corner. Oh, you, Petunia, Petunia. Petunia, you look at Scotland. You'll be proud. Look, you look at Scotland. Look, look at me. <laughs> oh, okay, she's looking right at me. Yeah, oh. Have a granola bar, Petunia. <laughs> Have a kind bar. Calm down <laughs> now. Look at that. Boy, so you hey, don't uh, feed Petunia, like, r- apples or anything like that. It's all kind of no Scotland. Bars. Expensive hipster protein Lara bars. bars. <laughs> She uh, only eats in bar form. That's the thing. When you've done, really? when you when you get ten horse kills under your belt, uh-huh. that's yeah. when you graduate to bar form diet. That's yeah, right. metrics, protein Met- bars, a lot of right. metrics, all kind of bars, which is tough to met- find nowadays. Tiger milk, metric, yeah, <laughs> metrics, protein <laughs> bars. Yeah. They're tough to find. Not easy to find, no. right? Especially in your neck of the woods. Where is that again? By the way, where's the uh, you rebranded? You say pa- well, well, in the Panhandle of locations. Florida. Yeah. Yeah. Two different locations now. Well, yeah. Right. well yeah. Yeah, the well, one is we, uh, placed down there, Florida. Tampa. Right. That's right. Uh, right in the heart of Tampa. Mm-hmm. Big, mm-hmm. beautiful arena. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. ours, of course, is, you know, it's not far away. You could just uh, you hop on the 405. That's right. And mm-hmm. you take that heading up northward. You want to take it north, mm-hmm. but as it veers northeast, right. you turn onto the 2 4 the twenty four? No, no, nope. nope. the, nope. the two for a long comma, time. Two, comma four yeah. highway. Two comma four. Oh, two okay. comma four. The okay. two four. See, I don't know if you know this about. I don't know how familiar you are with Florida highways. I guess unfamiliar. But yeah. in the early days, it was a mess. Oh, and okay. people would just shout out. No, that's a two. That's no, that's a two. All right, well, you could be the two. Why well, have I got a two, two? Well, if you're the two, two, then I'll be the two, three. I'm the two, three. Well, all right, then I guess I'll be the two, four. This two, is like three. drunk history. I love this. <laughs> Um, this is really bringing it to life with different voices. Yeah. Oh, b- your you character believe, work is oh, amazing. Beva loves it. Oh, <laughs> loves Maria Blasucci is gonna have a ball playing two three. <laughs> she's good. She's. I Very think talented. she's. I think she's the, if not the. Best there is. Yeah. So you know, the business is good. Business, you know, your business is horse fighting and sometimes riding and sometimes softball, and business is good. Boom. Yeah. Business is booming. You've boom. rebranded. Kaklumen, k- ship shoomen, mm-hmm. uh, make more rooming <laughs> because we're bringing the booming. Oh, we here comes t-shirt. the booming. In fact, oh, thank you. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Uh, that's yep. been there now. Of course, Chico, okay. semen, that semen? whole thing. <laughs> okay, I don't think Courtesy I was. Courtesy of Chico Scotland. Semen. 
That is oh, crazy that's chico semen. He did. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. Half. This it's goes perfectly half. on my tits. It's a yeah. half. <laughs> it's a half shirt. Just a little uh, half shirt. That's right. Thank you so little much. half shirt. The bottom. <laughs> so you just got semen all yeah. along your man right. tits. But that semen does not touch your stomach. No. no and we're very not. particular about it. It would that. not. Uh, so thank you for this. Last time. Good underboob. Yeah. La- <laughs> last time you heard. That's great underboob. I've, I've not been complimented on that. Scott Lee, I've seen a lot of hosts <laughs> on the boobs. Wait, you're doing other shows? Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh my Your gosh. business has gotten so popular, you're doing other shows. We're, yeah. we're on a press tour right now. Really? A mm-hmm. junket. Okay, so uh, what are you here to promote then? I mean, obviously you brought Petunia here. Uh, there must be something really sensational going on in your in your careers. This is exciting. I, I mean, last time you guys were going to have a horse off. You guys were fighting. We didn't even know you were related. Now we know you're related, and uh, business is great. So what are you promoting? Well, here's the thing, Scott Lee, is... As you know, we've put our lives into horse fighting. I do know that. Into Your our lives careers, have been devoted to it. Into our professions. Right. And as we've said, we've expanded. We've branded. We've left-handed. Mm-hmm. We've pan-panded. Mm-hmm. We've bajambered. Mm. And we've kind of become celebrities in our own right. That's right. That's oh, true. Okay. We got that big dick energy mm-hmm. <laughs> from the horse fighting circuit, and well, people want to know all about us. Okay. We're a trio of swamp donkeys, if you know what I, I mean. No, I don't. Should I Google that? Hung like a swamp donkey? You've never heard that. I've never. I, I, I'm swamp gonna, donkeys have just I'm ridiculously gonna put it, yeah, I'm gonna huge put it in flaccid. quotes. Yeah, nothing is coming out you of got, Well, you got to bang it, baby. Bang it. Oh, but look, <laughs> it, it does it, say. It does say, did you mean pick and book it? <laughs> oh. Oh, that just because oh, okay. that was your last search. That was my last one. Yeah, I they're see. wondering if I meant I the other see. thing that has. Yeah, um, so we got offered. We got offered a juice box commercial. What? That's right. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, and Mots. as I'm sorry, Mots. 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 Oh, mm-hmm. the like the applesauce. Yeah. Mots. Yeah. Apple Not just juice. applesauce. So they do a cranberry apple, a raspberry apple. They okay. don't just do applesauce. They do mots. Okay. They do mots juice. In fact, they, they do started matzo matzo. applesauce. Okay, so so they they do matzo applesauce. Mm. So did you take the commercial? Sorry, that, well, we're where that's that's those are the sides uh, oh, that we've did been you think we were faxed. Talk- we're practicing our sides. Oh, okay. We got an audition for it. Oh, maybe maybe yes. we were lying. A we second submitted ago. for an audition. You submitted. I remember the last time you were here. You guys went to a lot of auditions. I believe that's right. Mm-hmm. We've auditioned for uh, hundreds and hundreds of different uh, juice movies, box commercials, juice and- box commercials, TV shows. Mm-hmm. Uh, Our uh, agent. Uh, told us that we had to categorize ourselves something specific. So we said, like, are you a film actor? Or are you a right. TV and actor? We said juice box. <laughs> okay, so can so we you, checked that box? Uh, so I love wh- that a juice. <laughs> what did this audition? How did it go? What was it like? What did you have to do for the audition? Do you, Shall we do it for him? Well, sure, sure. sure. Uh, and obviously, you'd have to imagine. Uh, uh, I am on top of my brother's shoulders uh, right, with a yes. gigantic trench coat. And because, a- as I recall, yes. you have trouble with the with the words. That's is right. that what it is? And, right. and you, uh, Very Bever, shy. you, Bever, have to whisper up to him. That's right. right. And okay. as you re-see, mm-hmm. what tiny man is it is. You're tiny man. And when the breakdown came out, it said, this is a two-hander. Mm-hmm. That's right. They That's- absolutely refuse to see more or less. Yeah, I like. Sometimes they'll do that in and audition and specify how many hands a person has. That's right. And so, so they were looking for one person with two hands. Correct. And I'm Chico hands. <laughs> That's and right. you're Chico. So you just thought, hey, this is where I this live. This is meant for me. But if you listen last time, uh, you have no interest, Bever, in in acting. But I remember saying that, but Scott. You want to support Chico by feeding him the lines when well. your brother. And and partner in crime and business cohort Wait, you guys have a dream. Oh, oh yeah. Scott Lee, you, just, you haven't been reading the the research. Oh no, did something happen over the last year? Well, yeah. oh, we, oh, don't, boy. we don't. We don't want to allegedly. Talk too much. Allegedly, wink. things happen. Okay. There's no proof, but okay. we have been accused. Okay, well, it seems like it would be an open and shut case if there's zero proof. Let's well, just say that well, a also Russian Chico, oligarch... Uh, Chico's got some loose lips, too. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Chico, you've been telling people about this? I m- maybe might have whispered something while I was falling asleep after praying uh, to my god, Poseidon. <laughs> uh, that might have happened. Uh, so you, you whispered to whom? Was this someone Whomever with you? I had dialed on the telephone. I, 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 I dialed I, Allegedly. Wait, dialed, are you... You dialed 911. <laughs> Oops. 
Wait, so you, you did you? Uh, let me see if I can figure this out, this story out. Did you have a if guilty? If anybody con- can, it's you, Scott. <laughs> Thank you so much, Bever. <laughs> did you have a guilty conscience and you called nine one one on yourself and your family? Maybe. What and what? What exactly happened? Well, uh, they uh, there was an officer uh, came over. No, to- I know what happens when nine. But I mean, what did oh. you actually do? <laughs> to- oh, d- uh, sh- I don't know if I'm supposed to be talking about these. Well, the horse is out of the stable. Said, yes, Chico, yes. go ahead. This is safe. Scotley is a friend of the family. Sure. Which let's, horse was out of what stable? Let's just say. Well, it was Cinnamon was out of the Cinnamon? east stable. Cinnamon and- had gotten out of the stable. Mm-hmm. Okay. Anyway, That's not illegal what, right there. What might well, have happened? Now, we, have, a, a, and we uh, do have a saying. When cinnamon's out of the stable, bad news for everyone. That's what I am trying to tell you. Okay, I'm going to Google that. That's, a, yeah, no, oh, that's absolutely not Mama, coming Mama's up. Mama's favorite apron. I was like 5% through that. <laughs> that. Oh, too. gee. <laughs> That's all right. It's 20 times longer. Wow. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, so far, I've heard nothing illegal, Chico, yes. so you're well, in the Well, what happened was uh, a, uh, a a wealthy Russian man uh, contacted us about uh, horse fighting. Some sort of to... oligarch? Or... Yeah, yes, I think it was, an okay. oligarch. Okay. And uh, wanted uh, to inquire about uh, perhaps franchising. Uh, going uh, international. Uh, okay. A horse fighting uh, uh, arena. Really? So would this be in Moscow. purely a licensing deal, putting your name onto something, or did they want you to come out and develop it and, and build it from the ground up? It would have been a licensing deal. That's okay. right. We, we trusted Slap this man. Yeah. Why did you trust He's this man? Very well, you rich. know what they say, when you're with Oligarchin, you're family. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> so this Russian person came out. So, so far, Cinnamon is out of the stable. Yeah. And you Russian know what man they say out. when Cinnamon gets yeah, out of I've the heard, stable. Yeah, I've heard about this. That's trouble, and and that's what I'm trying to tell you. Five percent. So, <laughs> continue. So put on your hat, get ready to look for him, because if you don't find him, ten percent. <laughs> there's trouble in the horizon, and the horizon isn't just for everyone's eyes. Fifteen. Fifteen. Yep. It's a trip to Downsville. Twenty. <laughs> and if you go downtown, you're gonna find other people. Who are looking for trouble? So a quarter of the way quarter. through it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Mix it with mix it with cinnamon. Who's looking for trouble? And you got a tornado. Thirty of trouble. Oh. N- now get to a third. <laughs> get a third of the way through the same. <laughs> now you also. Thirty-three and a third. Okay. Thirty-three and a third. Thirty-three point three three repeating. <laughs> the mountains. Uh, uh, after the horizon. Five. Uh, 35. They, 35, yep. And they're looking at you like, hey, I didn't ask for this. 40. 40. And then, <laughs> it, but you say, I didn't let him out of the stable. 45. And uh, the, but the stable wasn't locked, <laughs> says everyone. And well, the you, stable wasn't latched is how it goes. We, you got halfway yeah. done. Start over. Oh, start God. over. God. I don't think we have time. Start over. This is going to be the entire show. Right. Yeah. You right. didn't even get uh, halfway through. The stable through. gets well, latched. Yeah, I'm uh, just when the telling st- you what the saying is. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. This but is on right, your mother's right. apron. It was yeah, latched. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Latched. Beautiful scene all over our mother's apron. Embroidered and seamed by my little brother. Finest semen on a mother's apron you could ever ask for. Very well, proud of that so scene. so and so if I'm getting this story correctly, cinnamon. I don't even want to say it, but uh, and then also a Russian oligarch is there. And what happened? Yeah. Well, we were in discussions to uh, uh, to uh, build a uh, license. Your name, right. license our name to an arena uh, sure. in Moscow, mm-hmm. and uh, and they started doing that. And then there must have. What been... What does that mean? A guy was at your farm and they started doing that. What oh no, that? no. Then they started uh, construction. Oh, okay. Over there. Oh, okay. So this, okay, great. And then somehow. So wait, so Cinnamon was out of the stable. Yeah. A Russian guy came oh, you over. you want to start that again? You and agreed. You know what they Sorry. Say. No, 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 no. But I'm just trying to figure this story out. Yeah. So, and then a Russian guy came over, and yeah. then they started the long, lengthy permit process. Yes. Mm-hmm. Of, and this is all in the last year of yeah. getting this. And so they started doing that. Yes, they because did. Because he saw I mean Cinnamon. Time. He said, look at the flanks of that beast. Mm. Right. How does a horse get so strong? Because mm. he was on his way to right. Disney World. And okay. why is he And why is he wearing a Darth right. Vader helmet? <laughs> right. Is what I remember. Why right. is he Darth Vader? You know, I can't yeah. do accents. Right? Yes, you 
you can. You're so great. That's the thing. He's the great actor in the, in the family, but he just gets so camera no, shy. Oh, no, it's a, no. Oh. It's a gift, but it's a curse. It's a imagine. gift, and the curse is knowing the numbers, Scottly. Mm. Not a memoir I haven't read, not a trades magazine I haven't perused. Oh, my God. And it's just you, unlikely. You love the business, but I'll it's a cruel mistress. <laughs> so, I love it. But get to the illegal part, because right. oh so then, many months have there. transpired. Did Cinnamon ever return to the stable? Or? Oh, we put her right back in. Oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> she, she's pretty old and slow. But so it was easy what, enough to say. get her right back in. You know what they say? Once Cinnamon gets back in. No, oh, no, they don't man. say that. No, that's just the whole saying. Once that is Cinnamon it. gets yeah. back in. Once Cinnamon gets back in. Okay, that's 100%? Dot, 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 okay. ellipses, and Sorry, that's it. It's, it's <laughs> once shorter. Cinnamon that's gets back in. <laughs> yeah. Once. So, so they started construction uh, of a horse fighting arena. Uh, and then we were getting into all the paperwork, and then... So they started construction before the paperwork was completed. That's but, how they do it over there, yeah, I okay. suppose. Yeah, uh, And uh, and then I imagine uh, there were some financial crimes committed, is okay. what it seems like happened. Okay. It's Long hard. story, suddenly clipped. And then <laughs> right. we pled ignorance, which wasn't difficult for, well, that's for them not, to believe. That's not an actual plea, though. You're either guilty or not guilty. Were you guys able to I say, said, I'm ignorant. I, I plead ig- ignorant. We threw all of our hands up and we said, I'm ignorant on this. I'm ignorant. Right. I'm ignorant. And then okay. they, uh, and the judge took uh, mercy on us. They said they weren't up to anything uh, nefarious at all. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, congrats. So, but were you up to something nefarious? I will never tell. Tit for, <laughs> tit for a tat. <laughs> Wait, a tit for a tat? Yeah. What exactly does that mean to you, Bisbee? Uh, you know what it means. It <laughs> means like uh, either there or here. Okay, I don't. You guys actually did sometimes do, nevers. Do, you you are guilty of these crimes. Is that I what mean, you're trying to say? Are you? Is this your roundabout way of confessing? Half dozen. Let, one, let me yeah. ask you this, Scottly. Mm, if yeah, if chartering a forty foot fishing boat. That's right. Heading down to the Caribbean. Mm-hmm. Pirating island to island, mm. storming luxury yacht, lot, yacht, lot, yachts. Huh? Yacht lots. We'd find yacht lots, lots where yachts were parked. Just parked, yeah. We'd pirate the heck out of them. <laughs> right. Huh? Break into the just saves, take the jewelry, the watches, the, burn it, the burn fine it. pieces and of art. And just burn them? Burn them down. Burn it all. Works. Burn all the yachts. Okay. Pirate away those treasures. Uh, right. Cash it out in the Caymans. Uh. Wire half that cash yeah. to the oligarchs in Russia to complete the okay. building of their facility. Okay. Uh-huh. For the horse fighting franchise licensees that are to... Benefit our family yeah. right. and, mm-hmm. and for generations to come. So this isn't if, pure, that's illegal, if that's illegal, yeah. then Which lock me up. They should have locked you up. Yeah. And by the way, this is not just your typical franchisee agreement. It sounds oh. like you were funding uh, this completely. I, no, it's not nothing oh, different than no, what Burger no. King does. I assume. It's no, actually, they would. They would pay you to uh, franchise the idea, not you they're giving. They're going to pay them. us. That's what they should be doing. They sh- you shouldn't hmm. be. Financing the entire thing through piracy. Well, uh, mm. it, 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 if they don't have a building, Scott Lee, then the the the, 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 the pittens we got up front ain't worth a hot damn cow pie. Mm-hmm. No, the pittance that you got up front would be worth what the pittance. A pittance. Right. Yeah. But okay, we were promised, you know, riches beyond, riches your beyond our means. wildest horse dreams. That's right. Huge for years to come. Of riches. Huge amounts of Let's riches. Let's just say it was in our bestest interest to invest in the futurist of this Russian-based horse fight franchise. So it, mm-hmm. it, has it been constructed? Well, it's, uh, from what we've seen, it's uh, about halfway completed. When you say what you've seen, uh, pictures or you've been over there? I just, uh, I just bing, uh, I just bing for bing pictures. Earth. Just I, Bing Earth. I go on Bing Earth. <laughs> you just put it in Russia and when And I zoom I, in, and then I've seen <laughs> pictures of it halfway constructed. Of course, I don't know when those pictures were taken. Mm-hmm. That's right. Mm-hmm. I yeah. don't know how often it's updated. That's right. Well, you've been busier, too. That's right. You've had your your personal time a little bit divided. Dis- oh, is this what, about when I caught that shark and tried to make it fight a horse? <laughs> Wait, no. what? Oh, okay. No, Chico. <laughs> but I do want to hear this story. Oh, yeah. Man. Tell me, tell me this before we hear whatever else. You could basically, you could guess what happened. Well, let's just say you I were on it. a on a bit of a pirate spree. Okay. And island happened. 
in the in various yacht lots, uh, stealing safes and jewels. Mm-hmm. Saves. Uh, is it saves? Is well, that, that the plural? No, that's saves? what Bever said. So Poseidon I, saves. <laughs> <laughs> like Jesus saves? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's a play on the old favorite. So, And, and uh, maybe I was, uh, one night I was out sleep fishing, and is I that, get a tug. Is that where you're asleep, like sleepwalking, yeah. but you're fishing? Okay, yep. got yep. it, great. And my mouth was doing the whole, you know, a, a classic, uh, yeah, me, 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 yeah, me, the like three stooges. Yeah. yeah, that's how I do. And when I walk, my hands are straight out in front of me. Yeah, uh, like and you're I go a mummy. I, yep, and I pick up a, a big old fishing line. Sure. Uh, and I cast it, and I must have got, uh, I got a tug, and it, and that tug woke me from my jolted slumber. Jolted you awake. Okay. It jolted me from my uh, uh, slumber to awakeness. Yes, your romp with Morpheus was suddenly at an end. Ex- uh, yes, I, uh, I believe that. Yes, and then, uh, it, and then, it what? damaged, it damaged your nightly gown. Yes, when you right. got that tug, it ripped semen from you. This, the <laughs> semen was semen was all right. Over so that this is this morning. is so, and and you're out there in the middle of the uh, the ocean. It must have been like a wet dream, sort it of. It was it was a wet nightmare. <laughs> right. Okay. Wet dream as well. <laughs> okay. Uh, and tugging just semen, semen everywhere. tugging at the semen. Right. Just soaking wet. Shopping <laughs> wet. It must have taken you hours to clean it up. You got that right. Did you did you put your nightgown into the washing machine, hoping no one would notice? I did. Yes. And, and now Bisbee and I would dead asleep. I found it in the hamper. Yeah. I, I still am not sure this story actually happened. <laughs> and it, I was like, "Why is there semen all over this?" Why? <laughs> and you yelled from the other room. You said nothing. Nothing, Bisbee. <laughs> And I said, and oh, I was covering, no. I was covering up my uh, genitals with both hands. Yeah, I, so, I knew I right would, away. So my question, I guess, I is, said, yeah. "Where's our, all, where's all our bait and tackle?" <laughs> right. That we was got, that was the part of the story you were concerned about. Where's our bait? <laughs> our <laughs> bait and tackle. I had a picking bucket full of minnows somewhere around. Where did it go? And I had to come My clean. Bait and yeah, tackle. Yeah, I yeah. had to he come, come away and now so you, clean. So you came clean. He came, came clean all I'm over. Done, us. Right. Clean. So my question, I, I guess, told. is: Was this fight on the land or underwater? Because I would, I would probably bet on one or the other, depending, um, you know, on where where this fight took place. I would bet on the shark underwater, and I would bet on the horse on land. Interesting. Oh. You, it sounds like we got we got a couple of bets placed here. Uh, well, I. I haven't. Pl- I mean, one place is, your bets. One yeah. is only placed depending on whichever. And by the way, this is this is in the past, so I would imagine you. How both much know. would you like to bet? <laughs> we may know. We may not. I Just only, take the bet, Scott. I only <laughs> bet on future sporting events, All right. not ones that have happened in the past. I'll start okay. though. Like I'm not going to bet on the 1928 World Series. Right we'll now. take that bet. Michael J. <laughs> Fox would. <laughs> The 28, he would? Oh, if he went back to 27, I guess. That's right. So, uh, who, who, where was it held and who won? So, uh, well, the, the fight uh, was held, it began on a sort of a platform uh, right near the water. Okay. And so I dragged that bastard shark up onto the uh, platform okay. that we had constructed special for the fight. That's Any right. water on the platform? It uh, was slick with water, yes. Slick with water. Yes. Uh, just a little bit, though. And yeah. the hot sun beating on that big old fish. Mm-hmm. You, you got and, hurricane season down there, so when you're building a platform in the middle of the Caribbean, you want there to be drainage, you know what I mean? Sure, so of course. It was completely level. So uh, we dragged that bastard up there onto the onto the platform, okay. and we let that horse go. So at this point, I'm favoring the horse because the shark is drying out. Yeah. There, uh, there's drainage. There's no water keeping it alive. So I, I would have to say then the horse would uh, stomp it to death. How much? Uh, you how, how, put, much you, how, how much you got on this now? How much you? How much on you, this? You, I, I mean, I, so you've just if you if you've described it accurately. Half a million. Half a mil, yeah. Half I would say half a million on the horse. Bisbee, take the man's money. Take it. Uh, right wait, wait, no. I mean, we don't take it until I, like, I, I either give it to you or you give me a half no, a million. No, no, we Scotley. make the rules, Scott. We make the rules, Scottly. And we are all gentlemen here. Okay. You're not going back We've on a gentleman's agreed. agreement. We've Can I write agreed. you a check or? No, we take PayPal. <laughs> Can I Venmo or something like that? You can Venmo you? me, yeah. Okay, where? Who are you on Venmo? I'm uh, uh, Chico. 
hands at AOL. At uh, Chico Dash Hands. Yeah. We've had trouble with that. That's right. Somebody's ended up with all the gotta money. Got to keep that half in it. You got it's it. Underscore. Yeah. Well, the dash is Actually, the underscore. That, one, that, one's a, that one's not working anymore. I'm right. just finding a bunch of Chico Hands at this point. Right. It is uh, yeah. Chico underscore Hands. These are all you. They're all They're pictures all of you. Yes. So <laughs> you kind of can't go wrong. <laughs> okay. At Bing. Dot org. At bing.org. Okay, so, all right, I Venmo'd you. There we go. Speaking of Bing, Bing, there bing. it is. All yeah. right. I got it. All right. Okay, so. And you were betting on the horse. I was betting on the horse, That's of course. Right. Of and course. So he's betting on the horse, of course. You win. <laughs> you won. Well, damn it. Damn it. I thought there was going to be some sort of twist. You just like, won. You won four and a half million been. dollars. There might have been if oh, there was. But there wasn't. So the odds oh. were. It this was not in our favor, Scott. It was no, nine we to knew one. how it ended. Damn it. <laughs> it was nine to one, and you I guys tried. Were... I was trying to wink at you guys, saying, let's not do this. Oh, oh. boy. It looked like a sexy wink. Like, oh. you were like, it hey, was. we got I this guy. That's it, what it felt was, like too. a supportive wink. Oh, it was. All right. Damn Damn it. It. <laughs> well. How are you guys going to pay me? Yeah, I'm going to Venmo that to you right now. Oh, okay. Boy. This is going to hurt our profits. For oh, me. yeah. Okay. Let, well, we nev- wait, we never told him what the odds were. So how much he made. So we never told him? Four and a half million. Four he half already told us. Yeah. You got to listen, Chico. Just did. Oh, yes. He 100% just did. <laughs> yeah, I missed that. I yeah, missed that in, in the crosstalk. You know, hey, it was a fair bet. <laughs> it truly was. Yeah, that, I can't believe it horse, worked out for me. If you could have seen it, the horse took one stomp on that. Just curb Shocking. stomped it. Just, just yeah. American history just exit. Said, by the edge, yep. shark. Right, right up the edge. And just stomped his <laughs> hoof straight through. Just straight, straight through. Sort of at the, the base shark. of the dorsal fin. They really yeah. gave it yep. good Cap- inertia. Blue. And sharks, sharks have so many teeth, too. It just yeah. must have just oh, crumbled all there. Oh, That's yeah. Right. He oh, whipped it God. around, picked it up, whipped it around, threw it probably four or five. <laughs> he picked it up with what? He doesn't right. have opposable his thumbs. Whoa. Because he had stomped Just sort of like clapping his hooves together. Yeah. Oh my God! He uh, Whip, uh, whipped uh, it that, around that like horse. A, it was that was which that horse was, was it? Trimax. That was Trimax. Trimax. <laughs> Big horse. Trimax was a genius horse, mm-hmm. and he would put opposite charged uh, uh, horseshoes on each oh, of his hooves, like magnetic like opposite, like magnetic, oh, so he could God. grip you. That's right. So they just you. Whoosh, 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 right, right together. The tail That's his anime. You never want to get those next to uh, like a shark's head because it'll just smash just it, smash right, it, right, right, right through, straight off. Oh Whip, my whipped gosh. it four or five hundred yards. That's amazing. So, did you film this or anything like that? To mm-hmm. we yeah. have it on film. We actually have some offers. Like a too hot for TV like videotape that you guys are selling. Or yeah, horse has gone wild. That's right. <laughs> One it horse is, in particular horse is the gone subtitle. Wild. Horse, horse gone has wild. gone wild. We keep horse trying to sell wild. it to Shock Week, but the executives <laughs> well, on yeah. planet Earth are so like, oh, the poor those, shark. Yeah, those are Shark's about the dead. majesty and how scary uh, they are. And this it, is just a massive yeah, chicken shit. <laughs> okay. Give us the goddamn about. money. This is good shock footage. <laughs> okay. Well, look, Pay we, us the money. <laughs> we, well, you're going to need some money because I need to get paid here. But we yeah. need to take a break. Uh, oh. When we come back, I do want to get to, you were saying that uh, uh, Chico here has something going on he, in his life. He that, does. We'll take okay. that bet. <laughs> How much that we're coming back? How much? <laughs> I'll bet the full four and a half million on it. All right, roll it, are, roll it into the spread. That we it. are coming Double back. Double or nothing. All right. Double or nothing. What's the odds? <laughs> Why are you doing that wink, sexy wink? wink, wink. <laughs> okay, we'll be right back, I hope. <laughs> do you find yourself, um, uh, do you, uh, hey, do you, do you, do you, what was I saying? Do you, do you, what was it? D D D D D D D D What was I saying? Oh yeah, yes, okay. D wait. D Do you do you do you do you do you that's what it was. Do you find yourself distracted? I do. All the time. Forgetting things, making mistakes at work. Yes. Well, you know what would help? I M H O. Uh, a quality night's sleep makes all the difference. All the difference. I got one last night. Wait, it didn't help. <laughs> I didn't get one last night. That's See, I'm too distracted. A right mattress. I will say, is the difference between resting, going to sleep, 
having a, a little uh, nice visit with Morpheus the Dream Lord and just laying down. Look, anyone can lay down. I do it on the sofa. But a, the, a, the right mattress, that'll help you slumber off to dreamland, my friend. And the Lisa mattress is the product of more than 30 years of experience in mattress engineering and hundreds of hours of testing. AKA, they are the right mattress, comprised of three foam layers that provide cooling, pressure relief, body contouring, and support. Over 300,000 happy Lisa sleepers agree that the Lisa mattress gives them the rest that they need. Okay, that's, look, it's all there in black and white. Um, I asked for them to send these advertisements in color. They refuse. They do them in black and white. I think it's cheaper. Order your Lisa mattress online at lisa.com slash bangbang with promo code bangbang and try it risk-free for 100 nights. The Lisa mattress ships direct to your door in a convenient box with free shipping and free returns. Find the right mattress for you at lisa.com slash bangbang and the rest you need tonight you will have. I like Lisa. I have Lisa. I sleep on Lisa. And you can too. Get up to $160 off the Lisa mattress or $235 off what? The luxury Sapira mattress and free shipping on the Lisa mattress at lisa.com slash bangbang and enter promo code bangbang at checkout. Wow. That's L E E S A dot com slash bang bang promo code bang bang. Good night. <laughs> Comedy bang bang. We're back here with uh, Bever Hopox, Chico Hands, and Bisbee St. Hancock. The yep. three best friends, the Calvin's triplets. That's the Calvin's is possessive. Is that correct? Calvin uh, That's apostrophe right. It's like Ruth's Chris. <laughs> right. Yes. <laughs> You into a Ruth's Chris? Oh, I love a Ruth's so Chris. So good. He yeah. makes us go to Ruth's Chris every every night. night. Every night we go. Yeah. Every single night. Every night. So you guys like eating cows. Mm. Big time. Oh. Yeah. We've been trying it. to sell them uh, horse meat. They won't take it. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, you, got, you have a lot to go around. We sure we do. Got plenty. Uh, I, I don't know if we've established it, but you guys, uh, you do horse fights at your uh, uh, bee, honey bee farm, as you were saying, Emporium, uh, where to the death. Uh, so 50% of your horses die every single day, and you have about eight fights per day. That's right. Uh, and uh, it's a good time to so go out there. Uh, you're in Florida now. Uh, before, you were just off the 605 uh, mm -hmm. to the 606. 606. Mm -hmm. And then the 607, 607. And then the 608 was a big roundabout, I believe. It's going to take you around as many times as you Want. Yeah, That's and right. sometimes you may want you know, spend half the day there. You might. Yeah, if you're having fun. You why could. end it? You. Uh, this is a thing. You could. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Bisbee. Uh, uh, appreciate the cosign on that, brother. <laughs> um, thank you, and thank you for calling me, brother. <laughs> okay, I'm technically not one of the Calvin's triplets. No, but, it means uh, a lot. To how me. do you I'm, know? Uh, That's true. I haven't done a three and me on Ooh. this, but. Uh, before the break, uh, and we also have Petunia here, who's one, uh, I assume, one of your champion champion uh, uh, horses. Uh, yep, that's right. Yeah. She's uh, had gone over 10 fights. I Reigning believe. June champion. Right. Mm -hmm. And uh, Chico, go uh, ahead and Venmo him back. Yeah. yeah. Could I have that money, and, by the uh, way? Yeah, I'm going to need the, you uh, get, you get the your, 9 million. It's 4.5. 4. There were no odds. On that. Wait, so I just get back what I put into it? It was not a good bet yeah. to either of us. So it was a zero to zero? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Wager? Even yes. Steven. Okay, well, I'll take the four and a half then. Yeah, back. I'm just going to send that four and a half right over to you so right now. So now we've just paid you nine million dollars? No, I no, guess no. I, I, only four and a half. Four and a half. Because he gave us back. He invested in the, the bet. First I put 4. in 4.5. Oh, we bet, a million. we I, bet that it would come back. <laughs> Scott had doubts. No, I didn't. In no. his own show. No, it was, the odds no. were not even even of oh. I get even money. They were zero to zero. It was zero. zero. Oh, you didn't bet any money. I didn't, no, he I, bet the money. I bet the money, the odds, but I, And he won, but the odds were nothing. But if I had lost, I got them back as well. Yes. I get the money back You regardless. get zero back. It was, no, I get my four and a half million back. But that isn't that what we were giving you originally? Yeah, exactly. And the second bet. The second bet You is, won. Yes. I won, but if I had lost, it would have the same right. thing. You would have given me the four and a half back. So we we gave him four and a oh half God, million. Oh, God. Enough. <laughs> he gave I want to hear about us. Chico's. 
I want to hear about Chico's big big announcement, you were saying? I, like I guess my question is, <laughs> yes. are we back? We're back. Well, yes. that's the part I didn't understand. Oh, we're back. Oh, okay. okay, yes, okay. we are back. Yeah, I won that bet. Although yes. I would have lost it, it wouldn't have mattered. All right. So we Chico. owe you nine million. No, four and a half. And I got it back. Thank you very much. It's in my Venmo now. Mm-hmm. Hey. So, Chico, you, uh, you have a big announcement that you were trying to say. That's uh, right. I'm getting married. He's getting hitched. Yeah. What? Yeah. Hitched like a horse? Yeah. <laughs> Tied down. <laughs> I, I like that. Uh, yeah. dude, I can't believe neither of you have said that to him. Tied yeah, down, why didn't you think of that down. clever hitched, thing? Hitched like a horse. Yeah. Well, because the do the horses get hitched or well, does the trailer? Well, they get well, they get hitched together. That's where the expression came from. For I sex? Is, no, they get <laughs> for sex. <laughs> no, I mean, I would imagine horses. Yes, they do have sex with each other. Yes, they That's do. That's how oh, you make new horses. You better believe they do. <laughs> You, you wait. So your horses have sex with each other? We don't allow our horses to have sex. But they'll. That's why we go to horse breeders that's elsewhere. Right. Okay. When we're scouting for horse fighting talent. They, so you. you but go, we assume that they do, you know, hoof stuff when we're not looking. <laughs> oh, they'll. So wait, so wait. So you don't allow your horses to have sex. So you go to breeders to do what? For the breeders to have sex with to the horses? To find a good horse that's fight. Right. Oh, okay. right. Horse fighting horse. Okay. Trimax, to find talent. Trimax is known. Trimax. To, to use his With magnetic, magnetic pod. Hooves, yeah. Magnetic hook. Hook right around the, the uh, shaft of a fellow horse. Right. And for some time, he will uh, Just, move that along. And, uh, and I would we think, will allow that. I would think that it would decimate the horse penis. It does. With the force. Oh, it does. Mm-hmm. Oh, it does. Okay, I'm not that's talking like neuter. in a pleasurable way. Oh, oh, that's how you neuter the horses. That's how we neuter. Trimax, Trimax has just retired, gets in there. And he's now our neutering horse doctor. Oh, well, that's a nice... So you haven't killed Trimax and put him out to oh, pasture. Oh, no, no. Oh, he's going to live a long no. life with those we magnetic coos. Could you that. have just kept the magnets? We, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> okay, sorry. They're on Trimax's hooves. You never dis dishoove a horse. You, you don't. You're a champion. That is Petunia. Petunia. How would you feel if we tried to dishoove you? <laughs> Come down now. Oh, oh, oh Petunia. Right. I didn't. I didn't mean anything. That's anything right. I didn't mean anything by it. Case and point. Okay. I just okay. asked a horse right. in front of you. Right. It would it feel like to have your hooves removed? This feels like a magic trick. You know, like stomp once for <laughs> two plus two equals how many? Stomp four times. She can do a real magic trick. Really? Yeah. What do you got? Petunia. Do it. Take out your deck of cards. Okay. <laughs> this is going to be good. <laughs> okay. Scotty, how much money are you putting on this one? I, I don't know what I'm betting on or not betting on. Do you, beli- do you think you, that Petunia? I'll tell you this right now. The odds are two to one. Okay, two, two to one. Out. Okay, for for what to happen? That Do I will you, be. You got to pick a card. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'll pick a card. All right, great. All, All right. right, now don't show Petunia. Okay, I won't show Petunia. <laughs> what am I betting on? Whether Petunia will know the card? We will tell you <laughs> when, when the, the illusion is done. Have I bet though? I'll bet the full four and a half. Four okay. and a half million. Four and a half million. All right. All right. Petunia, All right. Okay. Come on, we now yeah, Petunia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to know what I'm betting. Petunia's going to turn around now. Okay. Okay. Okay, yeah. And we're going to open the door. Okay. It's a noisy door. I apologize. And she's going to leave the room. Okay. Close the door, Petunia. Mm. Do you have any granola bars out there? Because she's going to eat all of them. I'll, I have gold bars out there, I hope. Oh, that, well, they're going to yeah. be eaten. Oh, no. <laughs> now show us the card. Okay, here you go. Okay, eight of clubs. Eight of, eight clubs. of clubs. Eight of classic, classic, classic middle of the deck card. Now, now, you ha- card. now I want you to eat that card. Okay. Eat it in your like ma- digest it or that, just yeah. put it in my mouth. Okay. Put it in your mouth. Can you really tear it up at all or no, crumple it? That old the I need void to do the it trick. Totally flat. You can roll it. Okay, Long I feel ways. like I'm gonna. I'm roll it I, in I can't roll it. Tube it. Yep. Okay. Dupe the cards. You do what you want, but if at any point you opt out, I feel like I'm being intubated here. Okay. Yeah, gross. Uh, yeah, you're the ones who wanted me to do it. He we did it. He we did didn't it. say it this wasn't going to be gross. Oh, oh Scotland. Oh. Oh. You know what they say. Oh. What do they say? Never, Never. swallow a tube car God. during a horse trick. That's 5%. Always tuck it under the tongue. 10. Because then, then, when the horse really returns really to the room, room, 15. They're going to ask you for that call back. back. 20. Now I'm sort of getting where it is. The horse is going to return and ask me for the card back. Because if you swallow it whole. 25. Number one, you'll have some tummy aches. 30. 
And it's going to come out the other end eventually. 35. And good luck with that. 40. But if you can hand it back to the horse. 45. Then the trick can continue. Halfway home. Oh, no. You know what? The trick can go on. Hold on. I'll start over. Start over again. Oh, no. We don't have time for this. We don't have time for this. So what's happening now? When do I get my four and a half million Well, I'm going to let Petunia back in. Okay. Petunia, come in. Come on in here, darling. He, he, did, did Petunia, you gold Petunia, bars? get this. <laughs> Can't tell what is horse Ray! mouth sounds and what is horse hoof sounds. Oh, <laughs> it's very drafty in here. Oh my God. <laughs> what is that? What is a human baby? <laughs> Ooh, ooh. What is happening here? I don't, I don't quite. I don't quite understand what's happening. This is, it's bedazzling. I can't believe what I'm seeing with my eyes. Oh my god! Ah, uh, now I'm gonna close the door. Um, Petunia. Petunia, yes. He swallowed the card. <laughs> <laughs> Am I being made fun of by a horse? That was just a trick. Petunia's laughing at you. Okay. See, All it's right. not a typical trick, All a magic right. trick. It's just a trick. So it's on just you. A, so to, to humiliate me. That's right. Okay. Okay. Did you hear that? Do you hear that? Of clubs, I heard it. Yeah. yeah. Was that so? Wait, it was. So do but, I win? Petunia just said it. I, so I win. What did you what did you bet? I, What'd you get? Four guess? and a half million and two to yes. one odds. So I yes, get nine I won. get nine million. And he said the horse was gonna cash it right? Yeah. yeah. No. The I, best well, I didn't day know but. for the Calvin's oh. triplets brothers. Man, nine million dollars. Man. Oh. Okay. I, I, I'll Venmo that right over to I you. I could not have winked any Sheepers, harder. Creepers. You were winking so hard. I, I don't, don't understand. Trying. You guys That's why I felt good about it. You guys know this horse can do this trick. Yeah, oh yeah. We taught it to him. So why are you Okay, well thank you. And all right, full confirmation. Confession, Scott Lee. Mm. That wasn't Petunia talking. That was me. That was <laughs> if you notice, I lowered my hat. Yeah. Over my mouth. Ten gallon. I did notice. My ten gallon oh. hat. Picking hat. So we have nobody to blame but ourselves. Yeah, That's but nice. yourself, actually. Yeah, I guess I it's think mostly these guys should be me. blaming oh. you. Oh, boy. We're all Damn. together on this. We go down. She go. Beva, we are that's running. Your, that's your wedding fund. Yeah, we are running. Uh, yeah, uh, speaking of the long. wedding, you're you're yeah. getting married. This is so exciting. That's right. To yes. whom are you uh, betrothed? Well, uh, her her name is uh, Marinka, and Marinka. Uh, I found her in a catalog, a uh, a Russian. Uh, catalog. Was she a, a model in the catalog, or was she? Uh, no, be- you could purchase a wife. She's being sold. Oh, That's okay. Right. So, okay, interesting. She uh, is so old. Very old. <laughs> how old? How old? Crazy old. <laughs> we like, give you a range. Uh, I guarantee, if we said guess, uh huh, you will be way under. From, okay, should from, I? You want to bet on this? I'll bet the full nine million on nine it. Million. Nine, million. nine million. Nine million. Nine million. Nine million. That there's no way you yeah. could guess her <laughs> actual age. Her actual oh. age. And uh, they, I'll go even further and say, no matter what you say, she's older. No matter no what, matter what I say, she's going to be older. She'll be older than that. Uh, no matter what age I say, she'll. No so is this the bet? That's, what, the what, bet. that's the bet. That's the bet, or is it that I'm guessing? Wait, that's the bet you're age? making. Well, so it's two is, bets. We're side pot. He can't get exactly. That's, that's that, what. Okay, and that but he's side pot is that no matter what I say, he will always underbid. Okay, that's so right. and how much money are you putting up? I busy. Me? Yeah. What are the odds on you on your bet? Right, I'm not betting. I'm giving you the bet. Yeah, I know, but what are the I'll odds? I'll put in six million. Six million. <laughs> so it's at it's at a nine to six odds. So it's yep. a uh, yeah a, a three to two odds. And what are and wh- what are the bet? What are the odds you on you? You won't get exactly. Yeah, and what are the odds? What are the thousand odds? That's to one. Ten, oh. Thousand to one. So three to two and thousand to one. No, Jeez. ten thousand to one. Ten thousand. Ten thousand to, to one and three to two for you. Yes. Okay, so I'm going to bet one age, and if I get it exactly right, if you get it exactly right, I mean you've just you've you've cracked the okay. code. That's so I'm going to I'm going to bet four and a half million on your on yours, and I'm going to do four and a half million on yours. Right. Two slightly different odds. Yeah. Uh, Ten thousand to one at four and a half million. That's <laughs> I'm I'm set. That's a lot of zero. Maybe all of the money in the world. Well, <laughs> so I we'll see if you can. 
if okay. You can do Let's it. see if I can do the this. Chances that you do that. All right. Let me think this over. Okay. So you. I literally ten thousand. So you think it's really so? I could win this by basically. I could win the three to two by uh, saying um, like infinity because that's the highest number there is. That's right. And then, but then on my four and a half million, I would only get back approximately three million or so of it. Mm -hmm. And then I would lose the four and a half million over here because undoubtedly she's not infinity. So I'm going to lose money on that. So I should guess something actually realistic and try to win both. Hmm. I'm going to say 47. That's right. Damn it! How did you guess a number that high? <laughs> Son of a bitch. God damn it. Oh, <laughs> that smarts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, yeah. I had a horrible feeling from the beginning Ooh. of that. I Ooh. said, I said, Bisbee, don't you do this? Don't you bring it up? And I said, it could be easy money. And yeah, but God damn it. That your odds were sane clock. at least. <laughs> Man. Well, oh. somebody get out a calculator because oh, that's going to hurt. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, 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 can't you, even, I can't even fathom it. Oh, Petunia's going to add up what we owe you. You owe me about $3 million or so. <laughs> yep. Uh, but uh, as for you guys, it's 47 gazillion dollars. <laughs> oh, my God. I am set. That's a lot. I'm set for like, can you just Venmo that to me right now? Uh -huh. Yeah, yes, yeah, so I'll Venmo that over. All right, thanks, guys. Oh, <sighs> Marinka you is should. not going to be happy about this. No, she's I mean, got a joint checking account. Fortunately, she can cover it. She that, can really. Is she? Is she a rich? She's, she's absurdly ex wealthy. Extremely why wealthy. A, why is she in a catalog? That's then? a good question. This <laughs> his Venmo account is attached to her bank account. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay. So uh, that forty-seven gonna, gazillion that should will, be right over there right now. That will okay. be noticed. That will be that noticed. Will by, be noticed. It, is she the she's daughter? going to be a flag. Is she the daughter of one of these wealthy oligarchs from uh, Russia? I or? wouldn't be surprised. I mean, you don't know. I mean, it's difficult her, to imagine. In order for her to be a daughter of someone, that means there's someone older than her that's her parent. Chico doesn't that? speak Russian. No, and she doesn't speak a lick of English. Not a word. Right, but her la is her last name oligarch. Yes, it is. Marinka Marinka oligarch. oligarch. Okay, interesting. So you guys don't understand each other, but she's very no. rich. You can tell she's rich because you joined your banking uh, accounts together. Yeah, she just she just sent you forty seven gazillion dollars. I, I appreciate much. it. I mean, uh, probably a, a couple million from us. So this is why you're so free with your money because there's a bottomless well of. As far as I know, yeah. Wow. So, ha so tell me the story. Tell me. I mean, you you ordered her from the catalog, although I don't know why she needs the money. That's right. Well, uh, it was from a Mad magazine. The back of a Mad magazine. That's a Mad he, he fed he fe folded the back page. Okay. And there her face of Mad was. Mad magazine. Okay. And, and there, there was she Marinka. was. And uh, there was a phone number right there. It said KL5. Okay. And then several other numbers. I don't want to give away what numbers. <laughs> right. But yeah, about a 555 five, five number. Yes. Yeah. And, and I called her up and uh, I said... Uh, hello, I have just uh, seen your face. On, she didn't uh, understand any of this. She said a bunch of gibberish back to me. Right. I didn't understand a, a, a word of it, but mm -hmm. uh, I got one of those, uh, 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 on my phone, I got one of those translate apps. Sure, that can uh, translate spoken word? Yeah, mm -hmm. app is short for application. Yeah, and uh, I just held it up to the phone, and then she would While say you were said, Okay, so th you were on a regular, on a landline? Yes, and, you were a and you were holding your cell phone up to the landline. That's exactly right. Okay, great. You've described it exactly Thank how you. it went down. And uh, I would hold, hold up my phone, uh, and she would say some stuff, and then the thing would, and it would translate that. And then uh, I translated uh, into Russian, hold your phone up to the thing, and it'll translate my words. And then we went through the sure. whole thing. Uh, so, and then, so when you say that you guys are not communicating, you guys actually, it sounds like... You, you're you understanding each other pretty well, clearly. phones are communicating. Yeah, unless, right. unless these uh, phone apps are inaccurate, which is entirely or possible. Or maybe they're sentient on their own and having a conversation that doesn't involve the two of you. Right? Yeah. That is true. In which... <laughs> Thank you, Bisbee. <laughs> Appreciate that, brother. You got it. Um, so, uh, so we got engaged over the phone. Amazing. So she's here? She's on her way. She's on her way. You've never met her? No. Oh, okay. Do you, 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 but you have but seen her picture. She's on her way to the studio. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. 
Amazing. Yeah. When, when are you guys planning the wedding? Or today, or? I, I think it will be later today, if she's okay with that. When you say later today, within this program? I think it's possible. Oh. It's a good time for me to say, too, if you need me to be your best man, I will be. Well, oh. <laughs> no. No, no, no offense, men. I'm just saying I'm probably most prepared. Offense well, received. I, Bisbee, I mean, uh, this here. This here being Beva, his brother, his I'm, whole life. Uh, but I'm just saying, I'd look pretty cool. I'm seven foot nine. I have a wonderful, wonderful suit. You'd yeah. slow down the ceremony. I would do no such thing. When, would, when I, the priest asks for the rings, you got to reach in all the way all down to that seven foot nine pocket. You yeah. got to pull it all, all the way out. Way out. That's called a dramatic moment. What's this suit that you have that you're so proud of? Oh, it's I did the semen on it. Stormtrooper suit. <laughs> it's, okay. a, it's a suit made of wool done in a pattern the, the, of a Nazi stormtrooper. That's right. <laughs> this okay, one's so, done like, like a Nazi I thought it was a Star Wars one, but... No, okay, no, 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 no. Okay, so, yeah, I don't know. I'm, well, she goes. I, I mean, uh, this is... Uh, I accept. Well, you don't have to pick I, I, a best man now. You just got to do it before the end of the show. Well, uh, okay, I, I guess I got something to think about. I In the I meantime, I accept. About? If you choose to do that, I'll well, just say... Well, you can't I, be so presumptuous as to accept. Who's well, out of the door? Petunia. Is it Petunia? Uh, Petunia, get in the door. <laughs> Bless, I am for Chico. Uh, Marinka! Marinka, oh, oh, oh my God! Her, it's you her, in the flesh. You, you, he's Chico. This, oh, I, uh, I am not Chico. Uh, my uh, name uh, is Bisbee, but may I no, kiss look you? Down, look you down, look down here. Look down. You is Chico. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, I, no I'm, I'm Belva. Bever. I'm Chico's brother. Look, That's and my twin. You're your best man. Well, look. we'll see about that. Allow me to give you. You, you is. Chico? Oh, I'm very flattered, but uh, uh, no, I, I'm afraid uh, Chico is is down and to the left of you. Hello? No. Hey! No. no. Marinka! No. I think she would say yet. No. <laughs> Marinka! Down there, Marinka. Oh! Chico hands! Down here! You is Chico? Yeah! Chico's I right am there. not Chico. <laughs> but I will give uh, you a welcome present to uh, America. It, Mm. Hey. Okay, now, hey. well, how are you gonna, how you gonna right. pick? I just was saying. This, well, this seven foot nine uh, fiance stealing. No, uh, I was giving her a sisterly cop welcome. Cop feeling, uh, mean. No, wheeling dealing hawkster uh, for your best man. No he just laid lips hawkster. on your newly arrived As Russian a bride. welcome present. I can't believe you just did that, Bisbee. It was a small, long kiss on the lips. It was a long. You consider that long? <laughs> it That's was a very long. That's the longest kiss I've ever had. Really? With tongues and everything. With tongue. Two, to be precise. I've, okay, so j just to paint a picture for the listeners, uh, uh, a, a, a very tall uh, Russian woman just walked in whose face, uh, uh, I hope I'm not insulting your future bride, Chico, mm -hmm. looks uh, a, a lot like two pieces of flesh that have been folded and put together. That's accurate. <laughs> like a, the back of a magazine, a mad magazine. Marinka. Marinka, yes, Marinka oligarch. Da. Uh, this is Chico, your, uh, I don't know what the word for husband is. Maybe you, uh, uh, should you bing, uh, translate? Oh, just bing it, baby. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, Gandusha. 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 Yes. Hey! Hey. Gandushka. No, oh, it's just pointing, be... pointing at Bisbee. Hey, if you're not going to take me as your best man, then things are wide open and I could take Marinka. Well, well, here's the thing, though, too. I'm still either way in the running for best man. That's right. So I feel like everything's so, yeah. coming up better. <laughs> yeah, you you have 100% odds on being best man. You want to take, take a bet on that? I'll make, I'll, make a, a bet. I'll make a bet. I'll make the entire 32 gajillion that you're going to be the best man All by right. the end of the I, thing. I, Go ahead and Venmo that. Bet. Okay, what are the odds on that? <laughs> yeah, what are the odds? Those are uh, one to 4,600. One to forty six hundred. Okay. So if he wins, so he I, gets I get a fraction. Forty six hundredth 
Mm-hmm. Of, of 82 gajillion okay. back plus my 38 gajillion originally. That's okay, right. I'll take it. I'll okay. take it. That's reasonable. Hey. Okay. Um, so, uh, this is... Marinka. Duh. Well, uh, I can't deny that I have just a, just a huge attraction to you. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, Chico. Yeah, well. you're, by the way, your erection is, is about Chico's, like, height right now. <laughs> It's like practically. It's as long as the semen on Chico. Get. <laughs> it's practically poking him in the eye. Get uh, that boner away from me. <laughs> yes. No, you deserve that. Stop it. Whoops. Talk to it. Respect it. Hey, how do you like that? Ow. Uh, ah. Ow. Uh, Ow. Uh, how are you getting inside it? Ha. <laughs> yeah. Get it away. That's right. Okay, it's it's died down. It's oh, died down. Right. Oh. Uh, Seems like Chico's picked up a thing or two from watching all them horse <laughs> fights. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Guilty as charged. Beating his dick to the dust. Trimax would be proud. <laughs> Marinka, Chico. will you come with me? Nit. What? Chico is Kadurska. She, yeah. she was so impressed. Mariko seemed so impressed uh. by Chico's manly slapping of Bisbee St. Hancock's penis that she now is. Hancock's in- cock! Hey, Ch- <laughs> yes. Chico. You're welcome. Why are you winking at me flirtily like that? Because I was doing that as a favor to you. Oh, my gosh. Oh. What an incredible favor. That's like the favor, the type of favor a best man would. That's right. Would would give someone. It is that kind of favor. Well, that is just absolutely impossible to argue with. <gasps> and... Wait, are you... If I, if I made Bisbee my best man, that would mean that we would win... The bet, and we'd win a whole lot of Scotty Ackerman's money right back. Really, only so I have five hundred grand. <laughs> I, got, kind of nothing I have to me. decided. There's no rule, also. What? That you couldn't have more than one best man. Uh, that's a fine point as well. But there is a rule. <laughs> you got to have a witness. <laughs> yes, that's you do. True. I, uh, I could be the witness if you both want to be best men. Well, now we need an officiator. <laughs> uh, I'm not quite. We Chica. also need a DJ. <laughs> I don't know. How, look, uh, Engineer hey, Sam who can who the do heck's catering this affair? <laughs> Where are the flowers? <laughs> look, I can't do all these jobs. Engineer Sam can be the DJ, but uh, Chico, have you ever officiated your own wedding? Uh, not until today, but I've, it's a good time to start. They say that uh, only a fool represents himself in court, but I, I think that you could officiate your own wedding. I'll be the witness. Uh-huh. You both be best men. I haven't decided who's the best man yet. We'll be the best man. Both of us should be. I've made my decision. What's your decision? And this is very important. The best man will be only Bever. <laughs> I win! <laughs> I win! Oh, God I win. damn it! Oh. We were so close! How did it happen? Is too many lost men. How Jesus. did it happen? I was that just I trying to steer you into picking both we so I could still oh. win. <laughs> crud! Oh. oh, crud, I did. Uh, crud is right. Well, 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 it's, it's, I it's never fully forgave you for calling us the shameful boys. Oh. Low, wh- wh- low that year ago. Oh. oh, the shameful boys. I haven't heard about that for a year. Hey. But look, we, we need to take a break. When we come back, we're going to have a wedding for the ages. Uh, this is incredible. Chico Hans will be officiating his own wedding to uh, Marinka Oligarch and uh, Bever Hope Pox will be the best man. I will be the witness. Engineer Sam here will be the DJ. This is very exciting. I'm not sure who's catering, who brought the flowers. We'll sort all of that out in the break. We'll be right back with the Calvin's Triplets wedding right after this. You know the saying, time is money? They don't just say it. Why would they waste time saying it if it wasn't true? Especially when you run your own business, but running a successful business involves taxes, contracts, a whole lot of fine prints. Just print it out as big as everything. Ah, things that eat up too much of your time. Well, if that's the case for you, it is time to turn to Legal Zoom. Legal Zoom. Over the last 17 years, more than a million Americans have used Legal Zoom to help launch their businesses. But that, look, that's only the beginning. Okay, Legal Zoom also has a network of independent attorneys and tax professionals who can help you with the advice you need to get through the daily grind of running your business. Not ruining your business, running your business. And the best part is you don't have to worry about driving to anyone's office. Oh, God, driving. Offices. (laughs) Or being billed by the hour because, look, LegalZoom 
is not a law firm. You can count on LegalZoom to provide the business resources that you need and service that fits into your schedule. Invest your time and money into growing your business and let LegalZoom help with the legal stuff. Go to LegalZoom.com now and use code BANGBANG at checkout for special savings. That is promo code BANGBANG at LegalZoom.com. LegalZoom, where life meets legal? (laughs) Pro tip. Pro tip. Here's a little insider travel secret from our friends at Hotel Tonight. There are tons, literally 2,000 pounds worth of empty hotel rooms out there right now just waiting to be booked. They're just going to waste. No one is in them. And Hotel Tonight has partnered with these awesome hotels to help them sell these unsold rooms, which means you get incredible deals. You don't want to just call up hotels randomly and be like, Hey, got any unsold rooms? Because they'll say, well, we'll sell one to you at regular price. But Hotel Tonight, that's the easy way to do it. Seriously, if you love scoring amazing hotel deals, you have got to try Hotel Tonight. Forget scrolling through never-ending lists. Hotel Tonight shows you a select list of incredible deals at cool hotels that they think that you will love. They give short profiles of each hotel, complete with all the info you need and pictures of what the rooms really look like. Plus, even though their name is Hotel Tonight, they don't work just one night of the year and then close up shop tonight. (laughs) And then they're like, okay, we did it. We filled all these hotel rooms. No, they are not just for last minute bookings. You can also book in advance. I did that recently. I booked about six days in advance. Had a wonderful weekend with the wife. Um... Kulap was at home. (laughs) No, no, no. Come on. Uh, Perfect for spontaneous weekend getaways. Three-day weekends, staycations, road trips, business trips, booking a place with a pool. That's what we did. And more. Uh, We used it. We went up to Santa Barbara. It was a wonderful weekend. Um, So to start scoring amazing deals at incredible hotels, go to hoteltonight.com or download the app. That's what we did right now. Comedy Bang Bang, we are back, uh, dearly beloved. Uh, we are gathered here to. Oh, I'm just uh, reciting my favorite Prince song. Uh, do you guys have a favorite Prince song? I'm just trying to. I'm here with Engineer Sam trying to put together the DJ playlist for the Bad Dance. <laughs> bad Dance, definitely. I That's like Bad Dance. Okay, so well, I need more than just Bad Dance, guys. Why? Well, we're trying to figure out a playlist here. Cup, couple different versions of Bat Dance. Yeah, just Bat Dance. You ever heard Bat Dance live? <laughs> Various remixes. I'm not sure you ever played it live. From the La Fontaine Theater <laughs> in Helena, Montana. <laughs> okay, maybe. Uh, guys, it's time for this wedding. I mean, uh, oh uh, Marinka Oligarch has been upstairs uh, gussing herself up, I would imagine, and getting ready. Mm-hmm. Uh, you guys have... Uh, gotten into your tuxedos and uh, Bisbee St. Hancock, you're in your Nazi stormtrooper That's outfit. That's right. <laughs> and you're, you're ready to rock. <laughs> you're, you've taken on a brand new, you have a very different aura about That's you. That's right. right. <laughs> very authoritative, if I may Everybody say so. Everybody sit down! Oh, oh my goodness. Calm okay. yourself. Dude. All right. Calm yourself. Me. All right. Well, as you can hear, the, uh, String section is warming up, and uh, it's just about time, Chico. Or, how right. do you feel? Oh, a little bit nervous. I hope I don't get cold feet. Well, as your best man. Hope I don't get cold hands. Cold hands? I, I hope I hope you don't get cold bed sheets. And I, Aww. as your brother and your best man mm-hmm. and your best friend mm-hmm. and your best bee honey Mm. Horse fighting, promoting mm. business partner. Mm-hmm. Want to say to you mm. that I wish you all the happiness in the world. Oh. And when you get in there in that wedding bed tonight, mm. just mm. keep your eyes closed. Very focused. Because I know how the, you get. Yes. Very focused, focused on the post. And as the runner up to best man, mm-hmm. I'd like to also say good luck. Yes. It's a hard road that many fail at. And Chances are, somewhere down the road, you'll have an opportunity to screw this up. And I hope that you don't, but I have complete faith 
that you will, and if you don't, Marinka might, and who cares? It's all shit in the end we die. Bisbee? What? Your attitude stinks. And you I'm stink. starting to wonder if you're even a brother you from the same mother. Well, maybe I am, maybe I'm not. Who cares? I'm, I care, I'm, and I will take the bet that Chico will not fail this marriage. I'll take that bet. What are the odds? The odds are death. <gasps> Whoa! Oh, my God. That's I'll a lot of pressure. Gosh, Don't. I'm glad I didn't chime in that I wanted to bet on this. So if, if, the, if he fails, you die, and if I, if he goes If he doesn't on, <laughs> fail, so, then if, until your death, then you die. Then I die. <laughs> are you willing to take those odds? Yes. Those Sissy gr- boy. Great I'll, odds for you, Bisbee. I, I will absolutely... <laughs> Take that bet. Dever, can I talk to you for a second? Yeah, yeah. What's this up, Scottly? This is a bad bet for Scott you. Scottly, if there's anything I'm certain of, <laughs> it's bet. This is a it's very bad I bet. am. I don't like to brag, but I am, quite honestly, probably the best better you will ever meet in your life. You have lost so much money to right. today. Uh, or, or has one of my favorite hosts won so much money? Oh, with bets, sexy wing. With bets that I was very oh, much in control oh, oh, oh. of. Orchestrating? This is like Now You See Me too. <laughs> my favorite movie. <laughs> my I knew f- that. My favorite movie novelization. <laughs> Here we go. In fact, I would like you to look at what I have inside Uh-oh. my oh. tux pocket. Oh, oh, I thought that was a Bible, but no, it's, it's a not, novelization it's of Now You See Me Too. And Now You See It as well. <laughs> Two. <laughs> That's on the back, yes. Yeah. <laughs> when you're finished reading, it's Oh, says, the books have kept going. It's a great series. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they re- call it the Harry Potter of Eisenberg <laughs> magic movies. <laughs> wow. Well, thank you for this wonderful gift on the you're occasion welcome. of your brother's so wedding. My point is, yes. don't you worry about a thing, okay, Scott. Thank you. Okay. So Will you take this bet? You a frontin' button. Big log lunting, dry humping, piece of wet toad swap. I will more than take this bet. I will take this bet to my grave. Literally. And, <laughs> and I will take it right now with a handshake on the on the probably failed marriage that is about to happen here today. <laughs> Oh, no spit God. Out. That is a giant loogie. <laughs> oh, oh God. Is. Oh, it's on the inside you, of his Do you have a cold or something? Why do you have so much congestion? Oh, please, oh. please stop it. Oh, but flam for days. If I know one thing about my recently acquired brother, nobody flams like Bisbee. Shake on it. Oh, God. This is disgusting. It flew all over the place. Oh. God, it got all over my underboob. We oh, have man. ourselves an accord. <laughs> oh, okay. Boy. Well, Chico, how do how do you feel about them I, betting on the success of your marriage? I I am uh, very concerned, extremely concerned. Mm. But I what guess can you I do? can't turn back now. Yeah. I guess unless I. Uh, oh, uh, you Chico, can't do. Chico, oh, you got to think turn, hard. How I'll, can you how can you fix this for your your two best friends in the world? Hmm. Think hard, Chico. Uh have a have an internal monologue that just is spoken out loud into a microphone. Oh, I'd like to hear this. Okay. Ding. Ah, that's an idea. Okay. Oh, okay. I decide on that. He's indecipherable okay. now, but it sounds like All he's right. come up with a great idea. <clears throat> I, got, I guess I got an idea here. Oh, and just in time, because look at that. Marinka. Marinka has appeared at the top of the stairway. Well, well. Look well, at her. I didn't notice the stairway in this recording studio. And here it is. Oh, That's the lovely strains uh, of Here Comes the Bride. How about this? Petunia walk in Marinka down the aisle. Oh. <laughs> well. Well, Marinka, here you are. That's what <laughs> what a lovely wedding dress. dress and is... I had done all of the semen on that. Yeah. So short. So short. It's a dress? Yeah. yeah. The well, dress. That's a it's, mini uh, mini. It's, oh. Uh, you can see everything. It, lo- it looks like Scott's underboob. 
<laughs> Marinka's bottom looks just like Scott's Marinka's under boob. bottom does look like her. And it looks like two things folded together, if you know what I mean, in the right way. I do know what you mean. I'd like to read that magazine. <laughs> I wouldn't mind having it explained to me. <laughs> After the show, I believe. That's a, that's so fair. Chico, after the wedding, yes, I Chico, suppose, yes, you're going to be officiating. I suppose it's time for me to officiate in this. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> uh, dearly beloved, we are gathered yes, here. Yes, we today already have that in the playlist. Don't to, worry. To celebrate a thing called life. Well, we have bat dance too. And bat dance. Worry. Great. We it's all taken care of. Don't worry. Go ahead and officiate. So let's cut to the chase. Dance. Calm down. Oh, we got now. a live one. Calm down now. Calm down. <laughs> this is my wedding. Now. <clears throat> We're just excited to hear bat dance. We don't get to hear it all that much. Now, Marinka, uh, you, are, you are gathered here today, and uh, do you take Chico hands to be your awfully wedded husband? Awfully? <laughs> Speaking into her phone. Yes. From the second I laid eyes on my future husband, Chico Hands, I was disappointed. Then, when I saw this man confront the giant one's large piece, I knew I had chosen a good partner for breeding. Oh, well, wow. that, that was really That's nice to hear from that incredible. telephone. Yeah, application. Uh, application. Could have yeah. been wrong, though. You never know. Those things aren't 100% accurate. Yeah, all right. Calm down. So and now you... Uh, look we'll, who's now. the phone app Nazi. <laughs> hey. Amongst <laughs> other things. Um, and and uh, uh, Chico... Want, Chico, yes, yes. Chico, do you take Marinka to be your awfully wedded wife? I keep saying awfully instead of lawful. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Speak into your phone application there. Uh, do it in English first, and it'll come out in Russian. I'm going to do it quietly. Okay. Well, we can't hear anything that he said. And now I will... Oh, my gosh. And I'll translate it myself, what it said. Okay. It said... Why didn't you just do it for us? The... No! It said No! No! I do not take Marinka to be my Bruce awfully you... wedded wife. I guess... Beva! That's, that's incredible. You're Beva. Well, well, well. He's just talking to himself. <laughs> How are you going to let this happen as the best man? Let me finish next His time, His internal Chico. monologue. Beva, you are witnessing <laughs> before your eyes the deterioration of your brother's one true love. There's a reason why I did it. You say, yeah, what's the reason? Because you... Because if, because if I got married, somehow it would lead to one of my two best friends being oh. killed. So by and never I could getting never let married, it happen. never getting married, you the bet off. doesn't even exist. The <laughs> bet was never consummated. Oh, I'm not going to let this rusky tear apart <laughs> well, hey. the greatest triumvirate that ever did exist. Fresh, get over the guy. What is happening? I'm kicking your ass to the curb, Marika. Oh, not the going down. Not the good guy skivrovat. You just got Chico. Not the curb that Trimax stomps that shark on. No, 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 no. No, 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 that's in the middle of the Caribbean, Scott. (laughs) Okay, I just want to make sure. What's Trimax doing here? (laughs) (laughs) Oh no, he's running towards me. (laughs) He's got Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! The magnets on Trimax's hooves slammed together and somebody cr- get the bounty! Crushed her head! No boy! Oh my god, she's dead! Oh, yeah. She's oh, decapitated! Goodness. Hold on, let me no, feel no, a pulse! No, wait a second! The pulse! Oh, oh yes! This crushed headed woman is absolutely deceased. Uh, oh, hold on no. now! No, What's this minute. here in a handbag? Uh oh. What's this? Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Uh, it, uh, it, it it's, looks like it's in Russian, but it, it's similar to our American checks. Oh, my gosh. Check. And it is a check, a check for 50 gazillion dollars. Who's it made out to? Who's it made out to? 
Scott Lee. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah. Oh. Trimax, no. Trimax, oh no. Oh, he's oh, going to no. throw it. Oh, he's oh, going to throw it. He's throw the headless <laughs> corpse <laughs> of, my, of our dear <laughs> brother's <laughs> almost bride. Oh, oh God, no. right against the wall. Oh, it's all splattered. Oh, Wait right. a minute here. Oh, God. Wait well, a minute now. That went south. It sure oh. did. But as I'm examining this goo that <laughs> that uh, used to be uh, Marinka. Uh, uh, not, I wouldn't say a beautiful Russian woman, but certainly a striking woman. What's this right here? Look at all of these wires and what? microchips. <gasps> what? She was a robot. She was a goddamn robot. robot. I knew it. Ah, there was something fishy, uh, wishy, smishy. The Russians, they sent Russian us some dishy. They, wait, they sent a robot to spy on us all? Uh-huh. No, they tried to break up. Oh, they're they causing division. That way, yep. they could own the, the whole Calvin's franchise. The triplets oh. franchise horse fighting international. They're trying to break oh. you guys up like NATO. We don't yep. go down that easy. Oh. oh. This is only <laughs> foiled the plot. Much like the end of Watchmen, this has just made you grow stronger. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. There's a movie called End of Watchmen? <laughs> you auditioned for that. <laughs> oh, I, I did. I never got to hear your juice box <laughs> commercial audition, by the way. we got to get back to that at some point. But this is incredible. So the Russians tried to break up the Calvin's triplets, mm. tried to split you asunder, uh, but that huh? could uh. never happen to these three fine, horse fighting, honey farming, brother loving gentlemen. Oh, and right. without Trimax splitting her head. <laughs> like a coconut, That's we right. never would have known that, that she right. was uh, all wires and microchips. Right. So many microchips. More microchips than, than really, I think, are necessary very, in a robot. Very, very complicated. <laughs> she looks yeah. like she was all microchips. <laughs> she looks like she was basically like a hull of human flesh. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Some wires built into the walls, mm -hmm. then just stuffed with microchips. Stuffed. It's just like a burlap sack full of microchips. A pinata of microchips. <laughs> Tossed together microchips <laughs> in a couple wires. Oh, my goodness. Well, I, was well getting, I suppose there's only one thing to do. What's that? Back to the Caribbean, mm -hmm. back to pirating, pirating yeah. raise a few gazillion dollars to pay off Scotley, burn down some yachts, sail right over to Russia, and take out our vengeance on our distrustful business partners. Right, uh, the, the oligarchs. I but think before it's a play. that, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Nice! There we go. Hey, just because you didn't get married doesn't mean that we can't have a party, right? Hey, who wants some punch? Let's dance! <laughs> Let's all bat dance, yeah. Chico. First Woo. on the floor. Uh, oh, 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 Look at those moves. Get a load of my moves. And those are the lines to the juice box commercial. <laughs> those were the lines to the juice box commercial? The juice box commercial. Oh, I thought you said jukebox commercial. I did. Because that would have made more sense with me. I, I did say jukebox. Okay, well, I want to hear the juice box commercial. Oh, all right, all right, all right. All right. All right. All right. That was fun that. to dance. Thank you so yeah. much for, for queuing that up. But uh, before we go, yes. I need to hear this juice box commercial. All, all right. right. Let me get right. on your shoulders now. All right. All right. All right. Get on up hey. there. Hey. Oh. And if you could just put that trench coat on. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure all the semen yeah. covers my face. There and you go, right. cover there it up. Go. And Scott Lee, if you, when you're ready, give us an action and also a rolling and speeding. Sound speed, mm -hmm. rolling, action. Okay. Oh. Uh, line. <laughs> you say, uh, Mom, I'm thirsty. But you're Hold in this, on. You're one Hold of the on now. <laughs> uh, I think we got that covered. <laughs> Thank you, Bisbee. <laughs> Okay, he put himself back in the trench coat. That is, of course, Bisbee's. Sorry about that. I'm yeah. still. Bever is the Bevers. one. Bevers. Bevers. <laughs> Are you talking to yourself again? <laughs> you better get this audition right for Scott Lee, your friend who you owe a ton of money to. It's all he's ever asked for himself. Here we go. Take two. Mm -hmm. Take two. <clears throat> Rolling sound speed action. Uh, it's hot. Line. It's hot today. It's hot today. That, that's true. Well, I got the burgers, but what's going to go with them? Hi, my name's Thomas. Hi, my name's Thomas. And when I sit down for a delicious, juicy burger... And when I sit down for a delicious, juicy burger... There's only one liquid that can 
pass through my lips. There's only one liquid that can pass through my lips. What can I get for you, Thomas? <laughs> Bye. Hey, hey there, Giardo. Hey there, Giardo. How's the store? How's the store? No business today, but that's all right. Line. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear that. You don't really care. You're here for the food and the drink. How long is this commercial? Line. It seems like a like one of those Super Bowl. It's it was full three minute like. It's a half hour infomercial. <laughs> oh, it, oh, it is. No wonder you have so much time to luxuriate in the storyline of this. Well, Giorgio. Well, Giordo. I will take a six pack of your finest Mott's apple grape juice. I'll take a six pack of your finest Mott's apple. Grape juice boxes. You got it. Coming right up. On ice or warm? Ice, you dolt. Ice, you dolt. Ha 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 ha. You get me every time with that one. Candy with it or no? Ha 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 Give me a box of hot tamales. Oh, Thursdays are always spicy. Line. Oh, guys, guys, guys. <laughs> this is a juice box commercial? Because yes. it suddenly turned into a hot tamales commercial. They said Mott's apple juice first, Scott. It's a crossover. Uh, Cross Syner marketing. Synergy. What goes better with a juice box? Brand, brand synergy. 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 Cinnamon synergy. Synergy in good company. <laughs> Synergy was one of your horses, right? That's right. right. Oh, yeah. So it's yeah. good company. <laughs> so it's good in good company. <laughs> okay. So is Scotly. Who won? Wait, so, Scotley. so is Hot Tamales. Oh, my God. And who won? So is Marinka. <laughs> and so is Mott's <laughs> Grape Apple Juice Box. <laughs> wow. And who's the winner out of all of those? Like in a fight? Yeah. Wait, that's what you guys do, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, but the, I didn't know if you meant softball or in a fight. Oh, that's right. I forgot. About it. Oh, yeah. We've almost done the full softball. Yeah. Nine players. Cinnamon. Cinnamon, definitely. Yeah, cinnamon's great. And when cinnamon is out of the stable. Well, you know what they say. When cinnamon out of the, gets out of the stable. Mm -hmm. 5%. That's the, oh, no way. trouble's coming. 5%. <laughs> you can look over at the horizon and see where cinnamon's heading. But you'll never really know. 10%. Until you get to the... Downtown. Okay, we don't have time for this. We, we're running out of time on the show. Just cut to the last cut to 5%. The yeah, the last yeah. five, please. Because, so your only hope is that. Is that? That's how it ends? Well, I, you got to back up. Uh, sort, of, the sort of like 65 to 85% is where the real the meat, meat of it is. Yeah, okay, so. I got it. Out of context, it doesn't make any sense. Well, no. speaking of 85, we're 85% of the way out of this show, and uh, the only thing left to do on it is called Plugs. Let's do it. Oh. Oh, wow, that's uh, that's pretty good. That was a play on our closing up the plug bag theme. Baggage time, parentheses, pre-prize by the human neighbor. Thanks to the human neighbor for that wonderful uh, plug bag theme. And uh, guys, what are we plugging? I mean, obviously you guys came out here uh, plugging your new Russian development, which uh, now who knows if it's going to happen because you need to go out there and en enact vengeance upon the oligarchs mm -hmm. who right. sent That's the robots right. to spy upon you. So That's anything right. else to plug? Um, yeah, we, we got a new line of condiments. Yeah. You got to laugh ketchup. Mm -hmm. You gotta laugh ketchup. You love That's it. That's right. Okay. What is? How is it different than other ketchups? Well, it's a, a Calvin's family recipe. Uh, so there's really? an enormous amount of honey in it. Mm -hmm. That's actually honey it, ketchup sounds kind of good. The maybe. nicest thing that people are saying about it <laughs> is that it's too sweet ketchup. Mm -hmm. That's the nicest. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. People have not been kind to the you gotta laugh ketchup. It and has. you know what? When you've invested a good size portion of your family's how much, wealth, how much have you invested in this? Yeah, same a same ballpark same 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 from the same so like as much as a ballpark would cost. That's right, right. the amount of a ballpark about two hundred million dollars. <laughs> oh my god! Did you, but you got naming rights, so that's we, good. That's right. Yep. Yes. And you know when people. Almost immediately call it an utter failure. <laughs> they complain because it is technically 
not ketchup. No, it's and honey it, with like chunks of tomato uh, floating in it. It's yeah. technically not even catsup. That's right. right. Yeah, it sounds disgusting. It sounds more like a honey product oh, right. yeah, than a ketchup, right. I would imagine. But First you said you liked it. Yeah, well, how quickly I mean, you change your tune. To t- well, you know, to tell you the truth, dipping fries in honey doesn't sound too bad, but then mm-hmm. you add chunks of tomato in it. Mm-hmm. Uh, is there, are there any other ingredients or... Yeah. Uh, there is a, a fair amount of corn syrup as well. <laughs> okay, why do you need that and with the honey? And cane sugar, evaporated <laughs> cane juice, <laughs> and three molasses, e- raw e- turbinado sugar. Turbinado as well. <laughs> Every bottle has 150 hot tamales in it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and a good uh, amount of... Uh, Mots. Uh, sucrose. No oh, Mots. Su- no Mots. But- Stevia. Each ketchup bottle does come with a little Mott straw taped to the side. <laughs> okay. uh-huh. In case you don't, you know, have a burger on you and you want to slope that thing right up. Okay. Sure, and how many people use that straw? Very few. Yeah, um, that's a waste of resources. I'll go ahead and say none. <laughs> okay. No, There's, no. There's but also you know a lot what? of saccharin in it. Sure, it might be a failure. It sounds disgusting, but you're here to promote it. But so. it could not be. In time. <laughs> sure, yeah. And no matter what, Scott Lee, mm. you gotta laugh. You do you gotta, gotta laugh. laugh. You gotta laugh. You do gotta laugh. All right, let's close up the old plug bag. Whoa, what a bag. It's time to open it. It's All right, guys. Well, this has been uh, quite a roller coaster for me. Um, it's and- been an interview for me. <laughs> right. Well, I guess I was using a metaphor. Ah, I was quite literal. Uh, yeah, you're very literal. Uh, you ever have roller coasters on your uh, farm there? Yes, we I mean, do. That would attract yes, some kids. Yes, we build them right now. Sure thing. We, yeah. We've invited you every time. we got to have you onto the, to the range. i got to come by at some Are these Star Wars ro- themed roller coasters? Some yes, of them. they are. <laughs> Most I- of them. And I, I'm, we're expecting the cease and desist in three, two. I bet it's in our mailbox. Hello. Yep. Uh, uh, no. Yeah. So, do you mind, uh, Petunia? Do you mind opening the door? <laughs> oh, that guy looks like a lawyer. Uh, hello there, sir. Step in. I'm having a hard time hearing you from the hallway. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm from the Star Wars franchise over at Disney. You might have heard of us. Yeah, what's your this, name? My name is Daniel Simpson. Daniel well, Mr. Simpson. 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 And we are immediately placing a cease and desist on the roller coasters at your farm. Danny boy, now you don't want to go ahead and do that. Well, I think, what is this horse? It's you. That's Petunia. That's Petunia. The one behind him with the paws. Yeah, that's Trimax. Oh, that's Trimax. You don't want to get, you don't want to get too close to Trimax, well, what, but. Hey, horse, why don't you back up? What the hell is she? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I'm covered in oh. blood all over my and, underboob. Oh, and defecant. Oh. oh, because the sound of when his head <laughs> hit yeah. was followed a few beats after <laughs> with by the sound of his body <laughs> defecating itself. Oh, oh. My. that happened. Daniel Simpson said. But let oh. me say. Crisis is averted. Crisis yeah. is averted. And try, man. In a situation like this, I mean, there's only one thing you can do, right? You yeah. gotta laugh. All right, we'll see you next time. (laughs) Thanks, bye. (laughs) Hey, everyone. Thanks for listening. And before you go, I want to talk to you about Hotel Tonight. By showing you top-rated hotels with unsold rooms, Hotel Tonight makes it easy to book your stay at an amazing rate. And even though their name is Hotel Tonight, you can book in advance. So it's perfect for spontaneous weekend getaways, three-day weekends, staycations, road trips, business trips, booking a place with a pool, and more. So to start scoring amazing deals at incredible hotels, go to hoteltonight.com or download the app now. 
Hey, this is Arnie from the comedy podcast Hello from the Magic Tavern, a chat show I host from the magical land of Foon with my co-hosts... Usador, the Blue Wizard. And Chuck, the Shapeshifter. Most weeks we interview adventurers... Wedding planners. Ambulatory trees. But this week we have a special episode. I am so excited to learn about the Earth lore contained in Pride and Prejudice. We're going to do a book club of Pride and Prejudice. And you said this is a well-loved book on Earth, right? Yeah, it's one of those books that people love or were forced to read or more... More likely, it's one of those I'm going to get to it. And some of our most beloved guests are returning to read the book with us and enjoy some drinks and food of a book club. We have Flower, we have Crom the Barbarian, and Germ. You know who they are. Maybe you don't give a crap about what an academic thinks about Jane Austen, but don't you want to know what a wizard and a badger think about it? Not enough spells. Not enough grubs. Not, Not enough, enough sword, sword fights. fights. Whether you love Pride and Prejudice or have no interest in reading it and just want to listen to a book club go really off the rails, you'll enjoy this week's Hello from the Magic Tavern. We shall defeat this book! 